everyone knows the real way to show that you're a mentally stable adult is with a Pokemon collection. Personally, I've been trying to collect every single PSA 10 Baneri that exists. I've got four of them. <laughs> but rather than looking at my collection today, I asked you to show me yours. I've ranked my viewers' Pokemon collections and found some really cool ones. So I'm going into this with a lot of good hope. I love my Rainbow Trainer collection. Whoa, wait, what do you have in there? Marnie, Volo, Cynthia's Ambition. I see that Charizard and that Giratina. Fantina's nice, that Nessa, oh man. You know, something I didn't realize is that all the Rainbow Rares have the exact same gradient. Like, you could just see the, the rainbows in the same place. Didn't they just get rid of rainbow rares? I thought they deleted them. Personally, I don't love the rainbows. I think that the new alternate arts are much cooler. But if you love rainbows, this is a really cool collection. Five rainbows out of six and a half rainbows. I'm really bad at these rankings. <laughs> oh, okay. Themed collections are gonna be my favorite. The fact that there's not only a Sylveon in the top left, this is the Pokemon Evolution Sylveon. That's the full art from Evolution. This is the one from, from Guardian, no, Sun and Moon. You've got the Rapid Strike ones, Dark Sylveon, the VMAX Sylveon. I'll say it right now. Sylveon is my favorite. Actually, just one moment. Sylveon is my favorite Eeveelution. This is like the top of all Eeveelutions followed by Leafeon. And I really like this collection. 10 Sylveons out of 10. All right, now you can get out of here. Up next, we've got, whoa, oh, oh. Oh, that's cool. That, how is that? That's not a nine. Oh, it's a PSA one. <laughs> I was gonna say, I'm about to go grade my Maride on and get a PSA 10. That's really cool though. I bet you that this was their Lugia from childhood that they got slabbed up. I love it. Oh. Oh, the Kyogre, the shiny Kyogre. I've never seen that card. That's Call of Legends. Wait, I own that card. What? I want to see more. I have whole Insta for this stuff. Oh, there is more. I got lied to. You lied to me, Cass. You told me there was a whole Instagram. I clicked. But you know what can't be messed up if you click the subscribe button. Please subscribe, please, please. Next up, Paper Koi. Ooh, ooh, good presentation. You, we got a black and white fan here. You can see N, the black and white tin, Stone Journer, Kiram up front, a Bird Keeper, Shiny Rillaboom, Shiny Cramorant, the giant cards. One time I actually bought four giant cards thinking they were a play set of regular cards I needed for a tournament. And then four of these Looney Tune looking cards showed up at my doorstep and I couldn't play. But it looks like you opened these and put them in your box. I like this. We're gonna give it Pokemon Black out of Pokemon Black 2. That's either like a really good rating or a really bad one, depending on how you liked those games. Jarvis, <laughs> start the ad. This video was sponsored by Marvel Snap. Marvel Snap is no longer just on phones. Since you're watching this video, I already know that you have an unhealthy obsession with card games. I know this because it's true for me. Marvel Snap is an online card game that has taken over my life for the last year. Some YouTubers take brand deals for games they don't play. In Marvel Snap, I'm level 3913. I have no words to explain myself. The game is just that fun. Matches take only a couple minutes because you and your your opponent play at the same time? If you're a fan of Marvel, TCGs, or just wanna see Deadpool beat up Ghost Rider, play Marvel Snap. And now that it's on Steam with full widescreen support, you can play from your desktop. It's so easy to get a deck that you'll love playing and the ranked experience is phenomenal. Marvel Snap works with hundreds of artists to make the coolest alternate art cards that exist. And you can get those by logging in right now. There's over 200 cards, over 100 locations that pop up in the game, and 13 hundred unique card variants. If you're watching this, please click the link in the top of the description to play Marvel Snap today. And if you click my link, you'll get the exclusive Mech Devil Dino variant. Thanks again to Marvel Snap for sponsoring this video. I'm gonna go play it while my editors edit this. Peter M with a, oh, a Zara Aura collection. Oh, look at that VMAX. That VMAX is so nice. Oh, look at that. Oh, I didn't know that this card existed right here. Wow. I didn't realize they made so many Zara Aura cards. Didn't Zara Aura just come out? No, that was Sun and Moon. Oh my God. When did Sun and Moon come out? 2016. I'm old. <laughs> Next collection. Mutton Chop Gamer. Think you can guess my favorite Pokemon? It's obviously Entei. 
These Mewtwo cards are sick. Wait, do you have, you don't have the X-Ball Mewtwo. <gasps> the most famous Mewtwo of all time. This one right here. It was literally whoever owned more of them won their game. That's your next step on this collection. But dog, these are really nice. I, I love Mewtwo. Huh? An enhanced image. I can't, I can't make them out. They made a gold Ultra Ball? Oh. They've got the Cynthia though. Yeah, there is a gold ultra ball. You're a sword and shield collector. I'm noticing now that all these are sword and shield after. So you just started collecting. This is a really good collection for sword and shield on. Five holographics out of seven holographics. I hope I'm not too late. Oh, the Pikachu collection. This is, I, I love V union cards. Whether or not they're good, they're cool. Stack attack, uh, that Lorantis. That Lorantis was a lot of fun. Same with this. Darkrai and Umbreon VMAX or tag team. Too sorry. Oh. Oh, the gold, the gold and the surfing Pikachu. Something in me that fiends for a gold card, right? Even though that the gold cards are... No are these real? Why is Ultra Road above the ability tag? And these these fonts, these fonts don't line up. One gold card over question mark. I'd talk to whoever traded you these. Oh, oh the Mimikyu and Umbreon. Oh, I didn't even see the cards. Wow, that's really cool. Hold up. One second. I got an Umbreon too. And they've got the tag on them. Imagine the tag fell off and I just lost a lot of money right there. <laughs> that's the that's the temple Umbreon. So this Umbreon, there's an Eevee, an Umbreon, and an Espeon, and all the arts connect. Very cool. Five Umbreons out of five Umbreons. Did you rob a GameStop? Why, why does your house look like a GameStop? Hey, cops, this guy, if anyone's GameStop is missing a whole display case, this guy. No, this is actually a really cool collection. I have so much trouble not opening up Pokemon cards when they're in my vicinity. Like I'm probably gonna move these two boxes back to my background so that way I, I don't lose all that money. Hey, Aubrey, I move! I bet Cliff would love this. Wait, you put the Cynthia in the middle. Hey, hey. 10 fat Pikachu G-Max over one shiny Charizard. Next collection. Man, I'm really glad that you asked. You know, unfortunately, I don't have that many cards. However, I can show you the ones that I do have. Ugh. So, starting out, obviously, let me set them. We got a whole book. Too many cards. Okay. Next up, what do we got? Ho-Oh. -ho. I don't even know what I'm looking I can't, at. Right I can't now. see. Bro, you got to turn the gamer lights off if Ooh. you want to... I, I couldn't read those. Oh, look at that Giratina card. That's a Giratina Let's card? Let's see, we got another book. Working on part two, I guess. What? The, I gotta go slow mode on that. Why Why are you laying on all your cards? Oh, oh, the, this collection is much more organized. Oh, you've got the binders of which set? You've got a, an emerald? Is that a closed copy? Oh, that's a real shiny. This is sick. Oh. This is an adult, you can tell. Listen, you go back to that one kid who had all his Pokemon scattered like he was Huel and Soul Goodman over all the money compared to this. Oh, look at that. You don't have the Charizard. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. You're just missing the Charizard. You're, you're just missing the Charizard. But that's a really cool collection. How much is the, the Japanese Charizard? Oh, that's not that much. Hey, Cat M all, DM me on Twitter and I'll get you that Charizard. This is, this is a really cool collection. I like this. One Charizard over one empty binder spot. Good ranking. Next we've got I'm uncomfortable. You couldn't have pulled it out, but... That's not even a real Pokemon card. That, that was fake. That hurt me. People yell at me because I keep all of my cards unsleeved on my desk and like they're, they're, they're nice cards. <laughs> Is this me in a past life? <laughs> We've got a sword and shield collector. These are nice. They've got the, the Galar birds, Victini. Oh, some old cards. Oh, that Typhlosion. I, these are cool. That Typhlosion's my favorite. I mean, you've got the, you've got the Guardies. You've got the Pikachus, but that, um, if you've been collecting since only May last year, hey, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a god dang minute. I need some explanations. We all know why people have that one. You're not getting away that easily. Thought he could put the Anka Animal Crossing in and we wouldn't catch it. Some of my favorites. Oh, oh, I gotta, I gotta. Editor, rotate it for me. All right, we've got some PSA mucks. You really like muck. Here's your water types. The shiny Charizard at the bottom. You just put that there to flex. Like, look, Kyogre, Kyogre, Cresselia, not water type. Legend cards, bring them back, Pokemon. Bring them back. You know what you're missing? Call of Legends, water energy. Editor, put it right here. Good collection. Good collection. I like that one. Uh, one Giovanni over every single Pokemon that Team Rocket ever failed to catch. Huh?
and Lugia. <sighs> Finish. What? That, that's a card? That's right. They did have a Mega Low Punny Jigglypuff card. I need it. A Raichu fan. These are e-reader cards. Is that a Holon Phantom's Delta species? Listen, just saying. That right there is a steel type Raichu. I'm not saying that the, the card game had Terabolism. What's it called? Terra. Terra type. Oh my god, I'm dumb. They had that in the card game before. More, more Raichus. The dark Raichu. That's the coolest one yet. No. Fire Red Leaf, green Raichu. Why are he sitting like that? Really cool collection, Lenny. First edition Pikachu signed by Ash Ketchum. Oh yeah, that's Veronica Taylor. That's awesome. Oh wait, these are the Pokemon Center exclusive. Every once in a while, Pokemon Center will have an exclusive card that you have to go buy something in order to get. That's what these are. That, I know this one right here is from the, uh, the Pikachu box. They did some boxes where they made Pikachu into different costumes really cool cool collection i love that sign card 4.1 out of 5 mom 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 mm, mm. next collection that was good that's this is not even pokemon this is one piece this is it's literally one piece oh but wait 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 that's right i pulled it i pulled if you know you know one devil fruit over the hockey no mimi i think that's what it's called and then we got vera v these are not the best lighting wise but some of my favorites oh yeah hey hey we love a good unsleeved collector Listen, if you got carpet, you don't need sleeves. Just uh, step around him. Oh, that's a cool Diancie. Oh, that's a cooler guy, Gardenia. Your guys' collections are so sick. I'll probably ask this question again in the future. So if you haven't already, join the Discord. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe. <laughs>